Now we understand that God is omnipotent, means all powerful, has all power. So what you and I call a miracle, listen carefully, is a normal act of God. It's a miracle to me, but to God it's not a miracle. That means if you have been graced with the gift of speaking in diverse tongues, another prayer you should pray or another desire you should desire is to be able to also have the additional gift of interpretation of tongues. Because the combination of both diverse tongues and interpretation, listen carefully, takes spoken word by God from the unknown to the known. It is possible for one vessel to be used to speak and the same vessel to be used to interpret. But it is also possible for one to speak and sit down for another to rise up and interpret. Somebody said a big amen. amen. So for tongues to carry weight and meaning for the saints, there must be an addition of what? Interpretation. If it's not followed by interpretation, the person who spoke in tongues is seen to simply be using his prayer language to edify himself. But if I do speak in tongues, another interprets, he gives understanding to the church. So, so somebody who may sense that gift of diverse tongues rumbling will stand up, speak in tongues, the church will be silent for a while, give reverence to, his, to God's presence. One or two things will happen. Is either the person who spoke supposedly in diverse tongues will interpret or somebody else picks up the interpretation and interprets. If none of that happens, the person who speaks, spoke in tongues should sit down.